house in Florida, the only reason I got to get it was 2.85% wow. fixed for yeah. 30 years. Yeah. It was virtually free that. money. I mean, it really was. projecting I, I and we know what experts right they never know but what are they projecting like, i've been saying all year i think it's gonna go up a little bit more and then level off i don't know if that you know who knows yeah. i'm i'm guessing but i wonder what you think being in the industry yeah you know that's that's the tough question because no one really knows you know you, you just kind of said out oh, the experts you know i've heard so many theories in the last year you, you know specifically about interest rates but I think most kind of agree with what you just said, that they're going to continually go up. You know, I've heard some projections of around 7% um, and then kind of steadily, you know, leveling off or starting to come back down again. Um, but I, I think realistically, we're going to be in a high interest rate environment for probably, you know, six months to a year before it starts to, to come back down again. And we may never see the rates as low as what we saw. You know, we, we, were, we were doing 30-year loans in the 2% range. You know, on a 30 year loan, my, right? My house in Florida, the only reason I got to get it was 2.85% wow. fixed for yeah. 30 years. Yeah, it was you virtually free money. I mean, it really was. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. You got that at probably the perfect time from an interest rate perspective. Um, you know, so I don't know if we'll ever, but on a positive side, you, you know, we, we hear that a lot where people say that it'll never go that low or it'll never go that high. I, I think we learned that that's probably not the right thing to say. It, it probably will go down again. It just, when it comes down to when. Uh, well, you're, and I you know, think in the short term, it's going to be a tough year. 